Oh, uh, Jimmy Young failed on that. Um, yeah, uh, clothes shops, revenge clothes shops. You get the picture. Uh, you go in, they come up to you and they annoyingly ask, can we help? And you fumble for something that you need. Have you got, like, a cross between a shirt and a shoe? Between a... Shirt and a shoe. A shirt and a shoe. Mm. A shirt mm. and a shoe. Mm. What sort of item is it? Is it is a top? It's a top body. It's a top, top body. body thing, yeah. Right. Yeah. It's like a shirt and a shoe. A cr yeah, a cross between the two. It's like... Um, you mean it's got leather on it? It definitely had a tread on the back. And also in its shape. It's designed for outdoor wear. Again. A top. The shape of a shoe. I've not really seen anything like that at all. Hey. Uh, hey, Paul, you at the counter? Yeah. Okay. Are you buying something? Yeah, can I have fish food? Hey? Yeah. Okay, so you're being served? Yes, I am, yeah. Okay, well, when they give you the pennies, can you just say, can I have more nice pennies, please? Okay, hang on. How much is that? Cheers. More nice pennies. Oh, hang on a sec. Yeah? Could you do something with that for me, please? Have you got a newer one than that? More nice pennies. Use the words. A, a newer, nicer penny. More nice pennies. No, it's just that I read in the paper that... How old's that one? How old? <laughs> Ask him if that's his real hand he's giving you the money with. Is that the real hand? Is that your real hand? So I say again? Is that your real hand you're giving me the money with? Yeah, I know, but they're not all the same. That's the thing, you know. Some are worth more than others in the long run. Have you heard about that? Apparently, apparently some are worth more, you know, if you take them back and polish them up and give them back to the bank. I don't know. This is OK. Tell him he's got a face like a planet. Face like a... Planet. Planet. This, one, this, this coin, apparently, has got a face like a planet. I don't know, they're worth more, some of these. Because of the colouring and the... Uh, I'll tell you what, just, just thank him. Thank him ten times. Sorry? Thank him ten times. OK, thanks a lot. Cheers, thanks. Thanks very much. Is this the one for me? Yeah. Thanks a lot. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks very much. Four more. Thank you. Paul. Oh, my God. Run. I'm running, man. I'm out of here. OK, that was Beck, and that was Paul uh, bothering a news agent. Perhaps you can keep his number, and maybe we could uh, do him next week. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, Paul, is he in the shop somewhere? Paul? Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, oh, good. Right, so what are you doing? I'm in Sloan Square, big guy. All right, it's sounding heavy down there. Easy. <laughs> it sounds trepidation. It's New York. What do you want with me tonight, you sweetheart? OK, how far are you away from the till? Uh, three yards. When you get the change... Yeah. Do you say to the tillist... Yeah. Uh, complain that the coin's a bit sleepy. A bit? Sleepy. Uh, okay. The kid in there. Here we go. Okay. Sleepy coin. Ah. Excuse me, could you replace this coin? It's rather sleepy. Okay, he's doing that. I've got another one. Say the next one's fast asleep, it's even worse. Oh. Unfortunately, this one is actually fast asleep. Could you turn it up for me? No, I, sorry? No, I don't like those ones. Ask if she's ever seen that coin awake. So Have you actually ever seen this coin awake, as in awake? Sorry? She's asking me what I mean. Um, Has she ever seen it awake, yes or no? Uh, have you ever seen it awake? No? So it's probably got that disease. It's probably got that disease. Confusion abounds. Suggest that they give all their coins tea and that'll keep them awake. OK, yeah. Is there any chance you could give this a um, nice cup of tea to keep it awake, please? There was a nod of agreement, but actually no hot beverage served. All right, give them all love from the elephants. Um, all my very best and love from the elephants. Thank you. And then leave. Thanks very much indeed. Goodbye. Courteously. I'm out of here, mate. Doffing your cap. I don't even have to run because she was smaller than me. <laughs> I like the way this turned out. It's uh, just turned into such a laid-back, relaxed thing. It was fun tonight. I've got my coffee. I'm happy. OK, go for a saunter. I'm out of here. OK, next week, just do it so you're totally bored the whole time. I will do. OK. Easy, mate. See you in a bit. Bye. Paul. Hey, Chris. Good loot. How are you, mate? Was, was a good loo in there? I feel a lot better for it. So now you've come back outside it. I'm outside the wall off now. And you're about to go back into it? With pleasure. <laughs>
just cross the road and go into the hotel. I'm going in now. Okay, I'm right as, outside the door. As you go in, be going, yeah, 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 in a really loud voice. Right, and just keep saying, the yeah. revolving doors right now. Okay. Really posh bit now. And a big yeah, right? Big yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> and now start hopping round the reception in a circle. Um. Hopping. I'm hopping, yeah. Big circle. Yeah. Got it, yeah. Yeah. Keep going. Oh. And if you see a cushion there, pick it up. Are there any cushions? Yeah, there is one. Pick it up and carry on hopping round. Do you want me to hop over to it? Yep. This is very embarrassing. <laughs> hop over to the cushion, pick it up. I've got it. Put it under your arm and carry on hopping round the room. Okay, I'm doing it, mate. <laughs> any attention yet? Yeah, there's a couple of very rich-looking Americans staring at me. Hop round, <laughs> smile as you pass. Wave. <laughs> and then kneel in front of them. On the cushion. OK, the cushion. <laughs> Put it down. <laughs> kneel in front of them, yeah? I'm doing it. OK, and start going... Juba, 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 juba. Juba, 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 juba. <laughs> Are they your friends yet? Oh, no, security guard. Right, so anyone else there who's in charge who isn't at the desk? Uh, there's a man... Oh, uh, no. What? There's a man sitting on a chaise lounge. You can see a guy sitting down. Do you want me to get up, then? Yeah, uh, uh, shuffle across on your knees. <sighs> Going... Juba, 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 juba. Juba, 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 juba. And then leap up and go, hi there! Hello there! Go and sit next to him. When you sit down next to him, yeah. say very friendly like, excuse yeah. me, sir, but uh, you're the wrong shape, you'll have to leave. I don't think I can do that. I think you can. Just sit down next to him, excuse me, sir, I think you're the wrong shape, I think you have to leave. Excuse me, sir. I think you're the wrong shape for this place. I think you have to leave. Apparently, you have to leave. Now. Sorry? You're the wrong shape, yeah, man. Apparently it's the wrong shape, man. You are. You are. Am I? Could you please leave now? Is there any chance you could leave? <coughs> I'm waiting for somebody who's in there. Sorry? Yeah. Can... I'm waiting for somebody who's yeah. in there. Can you wait outside? Is there any chance you could wait outside for him? Because uh -huh. your uh -huh. shape is offensive. Uh -huh. I think I'd eat less mushrooms if I were you. He said he'd, he'd eat less <laughs> mushrooms if I was him. Tell him his face is too wide and his eyes smell. <laughs> um... Your face is too wide. Your face is too wide. And your eyes smell. And your eyes smell. No? And in future, please, tuck your ass in. In future, please, is there any chance you could tuck your ass in? What's he doing? Is he blanking you? Yes. Is he getting looking aggressive? Yeah. If you can just, like, stride around the reception, do a big circuit of the reception, singing Shape, Glorious Shape, you, sir, have a bad one. <laughs> <laughs> Keep singing that and then walk out. Shape, Glorious Shape, you, sir, have a bad one. Please tuck in your ass. Looking at you is no fun. Please tuck in your ass. Looking at you, sir, is no fun. Bye-bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, let me out. Okay, go. Let me out. Yeah, you can go. Let's go. Go now. Let's go. Okay. Oh, my God. He nearly, he nearly threatened me. I know he did. Really? What do you mean you know he nearly threatened you? What kind of... He had coins in his hand. Coins? Ready to make the impact even more violent. Like a knuckle duster? Yeah. You fancy going back? No way. <laughs> That's me done, mate. That's it. Okay. Get in the car and drive calmly away. We can't even do that. The car's broken down. Oh. Yeah. Who did that? It's broken down. We're going to have to get a taxi. Can I call you there? Yeah, I'm here. Are you at the counter? It's, a, it's not a good reception. No, but it's fine. I can hear you. Are you at the counter? I'm just going in. OK, what are you, you going to buy? Hello? Yeah, we'll keep listening to you until we lose you absolutely. Don't worry. He's probably going to buy some fags. Yeah, keep at it. It'll be worth it through the bad signal, unless we lose you altogether. Hey, man. I'm with you. It's Dodge City in there. 
I beg your pardon? Is Dodge City in there? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Dodge Fibian. It's Dodge City. Oh, is it? It's Dodge City? Yeah. You mean you're bottling? No, double. <laughs> Are you are you at the counter or have you just nicked something? I've just I've just had to go outside because the till's interfering with the counter with the phone. Okay, well look, we'll we'll join you in a bit, all right? Yeah, I'll come in. We'll see if it works. Okay, so that's Paul who may by ten o'clock have a chance to ruin something for us. Paul, Paul, where are you? Just up Baker Street. You just said to Ollie that Michael Fish is there. What he's, are you... he's in the shop next door. He's not. He is definitely. What well, what kind of shop is it? It's one of those all night type uh, everything you want basically <laughs> places. How do you feel about uh, tailing him? I, I can tell him for you, yeah. Yeah, but do you think you can ask him a question? He's going to be coming out in a minute. All right, well, listen, um, you're in another shop at the moment, are you? No, I'm outside. There's, out, I'm, there's two shops together. I'm outside one of them. Well, go into Fish's shop. Yeah. And if you get him, it's a bonus. Well, I can't get a good reception in there. I'll have to wait outside for him. Damn. damn I want him. I damn. want him. All right. And now, <laughs> he's, well, he's on this local station in London. Big guy. Hey, are you there? Yeah. Okay, you saw me rambling. Here we go. All right, up to the counter. When you get there... Yeah. Uh, ask him if you can have a coin with a better grip, right, when he gives you the change. There you go, it's two pounds. It's a bit smug buying, isn't it? Smug purchasing. It's two pounds. Uh, right. Sorry about this. Could I have one with a better grip than that, please? Thanks. Can I have one with a better grip, please? It doesn't grip very well. Grip. Uh, can I have one with a better grip, please? Grip. And then when you get that coin, say, yeah, I want one without a Harris on it, please. A what on it? A Harris. Harris. <laughs> okay. This one's got a Harris on it. <laughs> Sorry? Uh, no, this one's got a Harris on it. Could you play one with a, without a Harris? Thank you. I don't have that. It's clearly got a Harris. I don't have that. Everything's same. Everything's what? Same, same. Everything's the same. But they've all got Harrises on. They've all got Harrises on. Yes, yes, Chris, that's right. Tonight. You must have one without a Harris on. Um, have you got one without a Harris on it at all? Point to the Harris. There is a Harris on this coin. Yeah, I need one slightly different to that. Thanks very much. I call the manager, you ask him. Okay. The manager's coming. Cool. <laughs> yeah, great. Tell him you'll blow up if you get one with a Harris on. Okay, I'll explode, yeah, okay. You will explode Hello. literally. Could I have one without a Harris on it, please? Without a Harris on it, please, thanks. He's, he's confused. Nobody here understands what I'm talking about. Point to the coin and say, look, it's a Harris. It's got a Harris. There's a Harris there. I want one without one. No, he's shaking his head in confused disbelief. Fall to your knees and say, don't shoot. Please don't shoot. (laughs) Paul. Yeah. Beg him not to shoot you and just run out of there. Could you please don't shoot as I vacate the premises? Easy now. All the best to you and yours. Okay. Run like a gazelle. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> nice. And now just saunter away. There's, there, mate. there's no drama. You can saunter down the street whistling. What are you talking about? There was a queue behind me. It was you. Oh. Should we make this the last time we do it? Never. I love it. <laughs> Thanks, Paul. Thanks, mate.